What is up, what's going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Shidukin, and welcome back to Project Main, where we are working on day number 5-0, yes, we're working on day 50, and today we're playing as Kitty Cat Katarina in the mid lane. Let's go ahead and rearrange our storeboard here real quick, and I said storeboard, I meant scoreboard, of course. Okay, in the top lane is a Cho'Gath versus a Volibear, in the jungle is Shivana versus Fizz, should be interesting. In the mid lane is me, Katarina versus Avaris, so I'm gonna cry my eyes out. In the bot lane is a Twitch Thresh versus Lucian Bard. So yeah, let's cover Katarina's abilities, I did do a video on her a little bit ago, but you know what, Project Main, we gotta do it. Every champion, alphabetically, once a day. Passive is Veracity. Spell cooldowns are reduced by 15 seconds whenever a champion that I have damaged in the last 3 seconds dies. Q. Bouncing blades, throw a dagger, dealing magic damage to target and to the four closest enemies, as long as they're in range to bounce to, and it'll also mark them, which, consuming the mark by auto-attacking and using your spells on them, consumes the damage, dealing more damage. Or consumes the mark, dealing more damage. W, Sinister Steel, very simple AoE damage ability that, if it hits an enemy champion, you gain 15 movement speed for one second, which scales up. E is Shunpo, basically teleport to a nearby unit. Any unit, it could be friendly, enemy, so like wards, minions, monsters, anything basically that's targetable you can teleport to, you, except for blue trinkets because those aren't targetable. And of course, Katarina's ultimate is Death Lotus, very iconic. You become a Beyblade for what, 1.5 seconds? 2.5 seconds, where you just spin around in a circle and deal damage to up to three enemy champions. It is the skill that Katarina's get pentakills on. This is going to be annoying as hell. So, basically with Katarina, you want to just stay safe and farm up as best you can. I'm going to take my Shunpo. We went Boots 4 just because we knew that we were going to be against the virus. I probably could have gone Cloth 4, but uh, I decided just to go Boots because I was kind of in a hurry to get to lane real quick. Um... I will most likely be rushing a Zhonya's, maybe a Ludens, we'll see. Still TB determined, but depending on how they go, they have a decent amount of magic damage because Shivana actually does a lot of magic damage even though she is an attacking champion. Her E makes her do a lot of magic damage, her W is magic damage, I think her ult is physical damage, but... Yeah, she does, she does mixed damage. She's very similar to Renekton in a sense. But Looks like a double kill going on on the bot lane, but the Bard is going to pick up a kill on the Twitch, and the Lucian's going to pick up a kill on the Thresh. We're currently CSing alrighty. We're just trying to, s just trying to survive right now. Okay, we're going to max our Q, our Bouncing Blades. Because it does do the most damage. It is the most spammable ability in our kit. Also, we got to basically just max it so we can farm from range. Because this Varus is a Varus. He's just going to try and keep poking me down as much as he can. Going to throw a Q at the back line. Get those. Uh, Katarina's W actually kind of has a kind of... It's a very deceptive range. It People think it's a lot shorter than it actually is. But you can... As long as you know the range of it... You can, uh, you can CS from an okay distance. Looks like Lucian's wondering if the Twitch took his E at level 2, which I'd assume he did. Unless he took... I mean, I guess Twitches take W first. Wouldn't really know, though, because I don't play Twitch too much. Just getting a little bit of poke off on the virus, as well as getting that Siege minion. Take an auto attack for that, that's fine. We're against the Shivana jungle, so I'm not expecting super early ganks or anything. Ugh, I missed that. But, we're basically just trying to farm out. We're gonna roam and gank. I did not take teleport, because I really don't like it this patch. After they pretty much just nerfed it into the ground. He's gonna take a lot of minion damage from that. Gonna pop a health potion. I kind of want this to bounce back to me. If I were against a melee champion, I would most likely be... Ugh. I'd most likely be using my W more to farm, so it would push up. 
But because he's range. Cool. Got him with the bounce. We are running ignite, he's running barrier. I have to be very careful of that. I didn't actually tag that when I loaded in, so. Now that we know he has that, let's try and maybe pop it. He just missed his ult. He's extremely vulnerable right now, because um, he basically has nothing. Besides barrier. He has barrier, and he has flash. I meant CC-wise, he has nothing, so... Ah, missed that. I ran Katarina for about a month and a half. Okay, he's out. Not really maining her, more like preferring her over most champions. For about a month and a half at the end of a season, actually in the middle of season 5. Because I was under the impression that, uh, that was awful. I was under the impression that, um, really, I ignited on accident. Because I'm bad. But I got an assist. Fine with that. Pop a health potion just so we can stay in lane longer. I'm going to try and run it out in his mana pool. Because I'm assuming he's going for poke virus build. Where he's going to go into like, maybe... Ugh. Actually, I really hope he doesn't go like Black Cleaver Yomus. Because that's annoying to go against. But I don't have any... um. I have very little armor right now, too. But to go ahead and back right now. Uh, I picked up an assist. We didn't really get that much of a uh, lead. But we are farming decently well. They have a lot of mixed damage. Varus actually pumps out a lot of mixed damage, too. So Yeah, I think for right now, I'm just going to work toward Ludens Echo. Buy a couple health potions, a warding totem, or vision ward. And run back to land. Pick up some boots to get back faster. Actually, wait, we already had boots. What am I talking about? Pick up an amp tome for a little more damage, as well as the blasting, or needlessly large rod. I really have no idea what AP items are called. Looks like the Lucian is doing very well for himself. The Varus is farming pretty well. I'm kind of on par with it. I should be able to catch up during this wave decently well. 1253, 259, yeah. We're doing alright. We're gonna try and maybe roam top, because Cho'Gath doesn't really have much escapes. Actually, I'm gonna roam bot. Shit. It's gonna flash away. Oh, thank god. I was not paying attention and got railed by the Shivana. Had to blow our flash, but it's not the worst thing for us. Okay, so it looks like the Twitch is returning back up. He's looks like the Lucian may have gotten a little cocky on his last few lives. Oh, that was a good hook crush. And that should be a dead Shivana. Come on, Q her. Got an E. Oh yeah, flash, that works. Looks like Fizz is gonna get out, cool. That was a, what, two for nothing trade? Nice. It wasn't even a trade, we destroyed them. We're gonna max our W second, because maxing E, I think only reduces, or increases the damage, doesn't reduce the cooldown whatsoever. And also W is of a spammable ability, does more damage, so. I always like to have that up as soon as I can. Mm, looks like Lucian pick up a kill on the Twitch. Very action-packed bot lane. Double kill on the bot lane, I should say. This Varus has just been chilling farming. So he is going for like a mana immune. Probably into maybe an Essence Reaver, I'd assume. Unless he's not going to plan on building any crit whatsoever. Go ahead and roam up top. 
have my ignite up to cut down Cho's healing that he may have. Pop a health potion so I'm as healthy as I can. On the way top. Just gonna pick up an assist, get some CS, and run away. We are 1500 gold, or 500 gold, off of the Luden Zyko. So, just gonna go back, work towards that. And actually, we're gonna pick up our boots here. It'll give us a little more movement speed than the 5%. Make sure we heal up all the way, or almost all the way, because we do have some awful regen. 1.5 health per second. Good hook on the virus. Flays him mid-air. That was an awful play, and thank you for feeding my lane opponent. Great. Fantastic. Absolutely lovely. Mid no F, but you gave him two kills. How does that help me? It doesn't. It hurts me so bad. No, it does not hurt so good. Oh, hello. Even though I am farming a lot, I'm uh, keeping up. Uh, it's not going to bounce anything. And I'm not even going to get it with the W. Damn. Oh, hello. Eh. Guess I can come up. What's up? Really? I didn't even get that kill. Back out. We can't fight that. Varus got his man immune. Looks like he's going for Caulfield's Warhammer. Probably into something. Maybe he's to Dirk if he is going for the Yomus. Juke that. Didn't want to get spotted by Shiv. Just going to shun Poe away. Gonna hang out in lane, because we did pop the health potion, so our health is, you know, is valuable. It's, it'd be a waste of gold to just back immediately after using a health potion. Oh, fuck, he hurts. Now that I have no health, I can back. Looks like Fizz is going for the tanky build. Shivana is there. Ping that so they know. Um, too many health potions. Just two. Make it double. Looks like the Vola Bear is teleporting in. And is dying. God, that was awful. I'm gonna see if I can just destroy this virus. Or not. I'm just gonna push mid. Because they're all bot and I can't do anything about that. Actually, they were all hella low, weren't they? I just missed an opportunity. That's okay, though. Chunk. That is actually is a decent chunk of damage. Throwing a ward in the raptor pit, in the enemy raptor pit, um, actually can be bene very beneficial. Because if the enemy Shivana decides to smite the raptor buff, the buff will immediately get procced. So that they won't be able to have the bonus vision that it, uh, smiting the raptor buff does for you. So it is very good for kind of like not counterplay it. 
but it's very useful. Looks like the bard is mid area. Currently 003, Lucian and Twitch gonna duke it out. I'm thinking. No, oh shit. Okay. Probably could have picked up a kill there. At least an assist. But I did not. Got level 2 ultimate. It's pretty good for us. Oh, come on. Help, 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 help. Okay, cool. Got out. Almost didn't, but I got out. He's not gonna die. Cool. He's gonna die. Cool. Let's work towards Zarnia's next. I actually might go for Invisible, because they do a lot of magic damage, and we do a lot of magic damage. At least the Fizz and the... Volibear actually does too, and I do. Thresh does. So I guess I will go for the Abyssal Scepter. It offers really good stats. CDR. MR. AP. But I think I'm going to go for that after the uh, the Zhonyas. Got my Luden's Echo, so... It's a pretty good power spike for me. It's going to clear up mid and then come take this Raptor buff. Or Raptor camp. Just so I don't waste any of my time. No lanes can be ganked right now, so... Finally got a kill. Is red buff only... Give bonus re... No, it does. Hello, Shivana. Shivana's kind of gum gank you. So is Varus. It's okay. I ganked you first. Got him. Shivana in this bush. No. Did she die? She did not. She's not running flash. She's exhaust. Tele smite. Interesting. I'm gonna just hang out. And that is why we hang out. Let's get the tower. I'll come help with Dragon while they take the tower. Pick up double kill. 404. Enemies not found. I say 404 because that's my score. My Dragon. I'm going to go help take that mid tower because I want some of that local gold. And then after that. I should be able to actually take my, or get my Abyssal Scepter, or actually I'm not going for Abyssal Scepter. What am I talking about? Oh, hello Cho'Gath. Mmm, 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 no guys. I picked up two kills before I went down. I'm happy with that. And now we can buy Zonyas. That <laughs> flash W. Oh, he's so gonna die. Yeah. He should have just ran to the right. Biggest counter dilution. Just run to a side. Man, I could have just gotten a quadra kill if I had played that correctly. But now we're fed. 614. Got Azania's and Ludens. Gonna go for the Abyssal next. Then probably Rabdon's Void Staff. Probably just gonna, we're just gonna go for this build. This right here. Lots of damage. Decent amount of CDR. Lots of penetration. Mm. I kinda wanna take Raptors. I was gonna go top and take that uh, farm from the Volley, but he's up and heading over there, so. Hundred and thirty four CS. Actually the most in the game. 
So good job, me. So he would he did go for the ghost blade. Um, most likely next he'll go for either black cleaver. Probably black cleaver, even though we don't have that much armor on this team. Oh hell to the no! Use my W to get some bonus movement speed. And come back to get my revenge. Just you can skill shots left and right. Sorry, Thresh. You are a very worthy opponent. Or a very honorable ally, I should say. Shit. Zonyas! I can activate it. The CC is too strong. Volley. Hello. 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 He's just gonna let them take our inhib, apparently. Even alright team fight. Twitch doesn't have a rune ons yet, so that's slightly a disadvantage for us. Because Lucian can put a lot more AB damage. Hi, right, Lucian. Hi, guys. I found y'all. And he's dead. Just like that. Ults up in th 25 seconds, because resets are beautiful. I'm going to act like I'm walking this way, and then run back. Oh, wait. They didn't have that warded. Never mind. That was a completely waste of my juking skills. My walking skills, I should say. No one's defending mid right now, but I really want this. So now I'm going to go defend mid. Okay, we just caught up back in kills. Good for us. Fizz is fed. Twitch is fed. I'm fed. So our carries are fed. I need 700 gold? Yeah. 700 gold. And then I will be able to buy my abyssal. What are you doing, Goalie? You're the worst. And if this only bounced one more time, you could hit an in or two more times, you could hit an entire wave plus a champion plus slash cannon. Okay, fine. Pick up kills. Don't let me come and help. Oh, okay. Don't let me come and help. Just gonna keep pushing mid. And come kill a virus? Nah. I'm just gonna take this mid tower. It's been bugging me. We have a mountain drake? One or two? One. Gonna walk away. Take Raptors back by my abyssal. They should get that mountain drag. Get it now. Cool. Increases. Oh, it's just versus epic monsters, isn't it? Yeah. Be too strong if we were against all. Buy my abyssal. I think. Which of these items do I want to buy next? 
I'm feeling like the Void Staff. Although, they're stacking armor, no MR, so I'm just gonna go for still a Void Staff, I think. Void Staff components do build into, uh, Rabidons. So I'll just build those components and see what happens. Uh, I just realized I need one of one more AP item. Maybe I should get like a no, not a Morello. It's stupid to buy items that don't provide mana or that do provide mana on Katarina. But I guess CDR. Yeah, I like CDR. I could always just go for the uh, Rylize. Rylize is always a fun item. You don't have chilling smite. So you can't slow me. I didn't get an assist. <laughs> get it. Oh, Hey, I got LCS. I'm almost at 200. Dope. No, I want to help. Damn it. Go for two. Mmm, mountain drags. Got to love them. Okay, we can Baron. Of course, now they know, but we can do it. Especially with Mountain Drag. Two of them, actually. Easy. Eh, let's pick up some kills. Give me the quadra, baby. Give me the quadra. Uh, give me the penta. I'm faster than you. Shame. Oh, he's at six health. Ah, the W, nice. These components. Ooh, so close, just straight up void stuff. Asu. No ace. Ah, uh, they spawned. I am eleven, three, and six with two hundred CS at twenty-eight minutes. Nice. I still have the highest CS in the game. Twitch is about to pass me though. And I have the most kills. Oh wait, Lucian has the most kills. Damn. I must prevail. I'm 100 gold off of my void staff. Come on, get a tower. Get a tower. Get something! Eh. I'll just go take a raptor camp and back. Because I do want the void staff. They're starting to build a little bit of MR and. What is he building that into? Probably a Banshee's, it looks like. Or a Spirit Visage. Most likely a Banshee's. But I want to have Magic Pen before. Even though I still have my Abyssal, I want to have even more. Cool. Got my Abyssal. You guys still have Baron? Cool, you do. Who has Baron? One, two, three people. Four people. Oh, wait. Thresh lost it. It's okay. Wait. Oh. How much? We don't have it for that much longer. We're at three fourths of the way through the duration of it. Okay. Oh, hello team. Or should I say hello their team? Jeez. 
shit. I did not play that well whatsoever. I went... Ah, oh, damn it. Here's what I should have done. Should have gone in, killed the Shivana, because I didn't ult until super late. Then I shouldn't have ulted at all. And then I should have gone straight for the Lucian. Just said screw the bard and then gone straight for the um, virus. But what you gonna do when you suck? I would just sell, not sell this, just undo it so I can have a little bit more AP by 20. Looks like stuff's going on. Oh, you dash right back into that. Oh, that's a dead show gath though. And it should be a dead Lucian. Oh, the jukes! I have flash up. Wait. Oh, he's not gonna die. Greed for it, please. Why would we surrender? Oh, that Q did so much damage to that Varus. The Lucian stayed. The illusion stayed. Ugh. I could have killed him. Okay, bye. You can kill her in a second if she comes back. I'm very fast right now. Where are ya? Nope. One trick with like Katarina's ultimate and like a uh, okay and um, Trinomir's W his mocking shout. Um, if they hit invisible units, so if you're walking by and you see your ability, see how it's kind of grayed out. If you see it like light up, it means that there's an invisible unit or it's like there's someone in the bush because you can use it to face check. Oh shit, I didn't have my Q up. Damn it. That was an easy kill. Var Voldebear is tanky. Get me in there! Shit. No! Just back out, back out, back out, back out. I went right onto the Bartle. Fuck, GG. That should be game. They have 280 carries up. They can push it down in the time being. Fuck! How did Bot feed the Lucian so hard? Maybe not, actually. They're not pushing super hard, and they only have one minion wave. They have nothing built up, so they shouldn't be able to end here. I lied. Maybe, hopefully. 20 seconds till everyone's up. We should be able to stop them. I say with hope. Nope, GG. Fizz is up. Be greedy, be greedy. Damn it! That was such an easily winnable game. Let's see how we did. I got an S minus. So I did well at least. I had more gold than everyone besides the Lucian. That's saying something. Let's see how we did. Damage dealt overall, most on our team. Damage dealt to champions, second most on the team, because the Twitch did pretty well for himself. 12, 5, and 8. 232 CS. Oh, 
God damn it, Lucian. Why do you have to beat me on everything? <sighs> well, that was day number 50 of Project Main, playing Katarina in the mid lane. She is a very fun champion. I would say she's one of the most fun mid laners right now. She's not really in the meta, but she's always that pocket pick that can either just completely snowball a game out of control, or she feeds and just does awful, which I have done plenty of both. So, yeah. She is probably in my top five mid lane champions if I have to just pick someone to play. If my team is decent, like my com team comp. But it wasn't the best team comp to pick into. You want to go into a team that has a lot of, like, chaos. Like, in the last team fight, if the bard hadn't have ulted, we probably would have easily won because everyone was focused on everyone besides me because I flash E ulted in. And you could just shred down every damage and then just clean up with the resets you get from your passive. But it was unable to do it because the bard fates or not fates call the bard whatever his ultimate took me down. But that's how this game goes. You win, you lose, you learn. Thank you all very much for watching. Please check out the project mains that I have done in the past. Stay tuned and subscribe for the ones I will do in the future. And as always, I hope you all have a wonderful day. <laughs>